Hello everybody, no created one here. And I uh, will be showing you some <coughs> basic uh Majora's Mask speedrun like tricks and tactics. One of the most common uh thing uh techniques you will find is hovering. And how to and uh before that you will see ISG. What is ISG? ISG is when you, is your sword being in motion the whole time, like time and it looks like you see this little white stuff that like follows the sword or whatever, that is basically always going on your sword. Like right now I'd be slashing around. So to do it you have to place a bomb. Fail. But yeah you have to place a bomb and you have to <coughs> jab it with the that. You have to go like this toward it. And then quickly uh after sh after like right right here that. While slashing, you have to pick it up, and you should get a little flashing sword. Like that. Alright, now to see, to, to note if you have ice cheek, you have to backflip and take out your sword. So you have this little flashing sword. Your sword is now always in motion. But there's several things that can, uh, basically cancel it out. Uh, shielding without, uh, like, this shield is fine, but if you don't Z target, then you will uh you'll lose it. Uh, yeah, that's been using. I think masks will, like transformation masks, will do it. Uh, so there there are quite a couple things. Uh, now to hover, what you want to do is you want to is you want to backflip and use a sh and use it bomb chew and shield at the same time, like. And you'll hover in the air. And you can... The later you, uh, use your bomb shoes, the more distance you can get. The earlier you use your bomb shoes, then, uh... The more height you get. You can also mega flip, but that includes a lot of pause buffering, and, uh... Yeah, decent. Pretty boring. But yeah, you can do that as long as you have bomb shoes. Uh, you can also... Bomb shoe against the wall like this. Normally, if you bomb shoot against the wall, the bomb shoot would go up and you'd fall. But if you do it, if you uh, use your bomb shoe quick enough, you can uh, you can uh, avoid doing that, and your bomb shoe would go down the thing. Oh yeah, another thing about ISG, you can't fall off of a, you can't like fall off of ledges or anything and stuff, which is pretty useful, especially when you're doing the wrong warp to Snowhead, and so. In the Gelf of Ledge or something, you have to, like, backflip or side hop. So, yeah, that is, uh, uh, ISG and hovering. You can also do it the same thing with bombs, so. Even, like, the bomb you get ISG off of, you have to wait. But you do have to use a bomb chew if you're, if you're, like, going up, and you have to use a bomb chew right, right, uh, right after you use it. Otherwise, you'll just drop, like, you get this. Oh, that, that was crappy. Okay. Alright, so... Hey, just drop before you can pull out another bomb, so... Unless you are actually above a, a uh, gap. I'm not sure how far the gap is, but, like, if it's an endless gap, then, yeah, you can use bombs, like... Like this, you can. So, yeah, oh. Also, if you want to change directions wh during a while you're hovering, you you use a bomb chew and lock onto the bomb chew. Like that. And then, uh, you have to maneuver your way. Uh, if you're trying to change, like... It, you have to, you have to kind of mess with it until you get, until you get the angle you want. Like there, just turn 90 degrees or whatever. If you need it. So that is ISG and hovering. Uh, yeah, it's basically <coughs> it. Um, yeah, you can also mega flip during uh, during I during hovering and stuff, but I'm not that good at mega flipping. Some speedrunners can do it at will. Uh, my recommendation would be Ing X24. His speedrun of this game was phenomenal. Uh, with the, uh, 
quite heavy use of mega flips without having to pause buffer. So yes, that is <coughs> ISG. See, that's the way. So yeah, next time I'll be showing you stuff like this. See you next time.